I'm Shiva. I'm Sandy. And this is Our, Our Relaxing, Relaxing Hobby. Hobby. So it's going to be on trumpets, well, snails in general, but uh, trumpet snails, trumpet snails, uh, the bane of Shiva's existence <laughs> right now. Right now, um, yes. This week's bane of our existence is yeah. <laughs> You've always got something. Yeah. Uh, uh, she's decided that uh, somehow on a plant or something, she got trumpet snails got into her um, pleco, her pleco uh, aquarium. aquarium, the breeding aquarium, the breeding aquarium, and they have taken over. Like literally, I have some video. I don't know how great it is because it's hard for me to see them when I'm in the video. But it's there were thousands of them. Oh yeah. And uh, so she's doing a complete clean of this tank, mm -hmm. which requires her to basically take all of the plecos and the babies and the and the ornaments out and yeah. dry the ornaments out, which might lose some eggs. Did you find any eggs in them? Um, Probably. No, I didn't. But there might have been. Yeah, and. Um, Get all the ornaments out, uh, dry them out, get the snails off, clean the snails out, clean all the all the all the uh, gravel. Everything well, has to be cleaned. All the gravel's getting thrown out and putting fresh yeah. gravel in. Yeah, it's uh, uh, it's, it's a plants. big whole thing. So all the plecos yeah. had to be moved, and I I'll have to get you I'll have to get some video of how many plecos you put. Oh in the, my god, I didn't even count. I mean, yeah, there, there's too many to count. Yeah, uh, basically. There but are, anyway, they don't know about snails. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Sna so, yeah. Trumpets. Yes. Yeah, trumpet snails in particular are a pain in the ass because this breed of snail is practically born pregnant. Right. So they if breed you quickly, see fast, thousands, thousands yeah. of them. They multiply, and snails are invasive to us with the with the filters and such because they. I mean, we don't have the same type of filter, so not in the sponge filters it doesn't really apply. But the other filters, they block everything and they clog it up and they they get everywhere. They. Yeah. Ugh, they're na I don't like snails. They're, they're a mess and. Yeah. It's, it's very difficult because, you know, some snails are not as prolific as the trumpets are. The trumpets, this is my first time dealing with trumpets. Yeah, this is the first Thankfully, time I've ever, I've never seen them until this is the first time I've yeah. ever seen them. You're, yeah. Thankfully, it was only one tank and we were able to contain it to just one tank. But I noticed it about a month ago. I looked in at, on my baby tank and I saw all these things against the glass, which I thought, figured thought they were, were babies. the baby of yeah. plecos until yeah. I got a closer look and realized that they were these weird looking horn little shaped uh, yeah. uh, snails. Yeah, they're like, not the nice curl. Well, and no snail is a good snail to me, but yeah, no, uh, I'm sure they are. The, some, the big, the big, the big snails. Some people get the big snails to like help the them. apple snails and whatnot. To help, but no, these, these are not them. These are little yeah, tiny these annoying. Look like, these look like little unicorn horns. Yeah, but um, they're trumpet snails, Malaysian trumpet snails. And they probably one probably came in on a plant, and unlike other snails, all it takes is one because these snails are quite literally born pregnant. So one gets in there, and next thing you know, you got a hundred. Next thing you know, you got a thousand. Next time, you think you know, you got a million. I must and that's kind of what it looks like. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I had a uh, sixteen ounce uh, foam cup, and the first time it had an explosion, and there were literally hundreds and hundreds of them on the glass. So I'm sitting here scooping them out and I feel almost filled an entire 16 ounce cup. Yeah. And that didn't even make a dent. And really. it didn't even really make a dent. And I was like, oh my god, this is insane. Now I have a loach in that tank and the loach was just like, don't look at me. This is right. way too much. Yeah. yeah. So I mean my I my mean, loaches do a pretty good job with the what are the other kinds of the ram's horn. The ram's horn snails. Every once in a while I'll get one that makes it past them, but it's few and far between in mine. I have two I have a I have a yo yo loach and a clown loach. And they keep pretty good, um, and I know that your mom's clown loach keeps a pretty good. Uh, some of the some of them do better than others. Yeah. Meanwhile, my yo-yo. Uh, yeah, her yo-yo, her yo-yo loach slacker. doesn't quite. Yeah, he doesn't quite keep up. Yeah. But I think it honestly, you know, I mean, it just depends. Yeah. But so, but yeah, they couldn't have kept up with that one. Yeah, but the trumpet snails, it was just an explosion, and then I was keeping them somewhat under control by salting the water. But you can't do a lot of salt in the water, especially when you have baby plecos in there. Yeah, so I would put a little bit, and then I wouldn't see the snails for a while. Yeah. It's like, okay, maybe I killed them all off. And then after about two weeks, Then bam. they laughed at her, and then they yeah. said, okay, well, those those adult ones died, but you just made room for all the babies that were already here. Oh, my God. Or something. <laughs> so I would literally be pulling, you know, thousands of snails out of yeah. this tank. And then finally, today, it was like, okay, enough's enough. I've really just got to do a complete purge. Right. So it was snail purge day. 
And because these little fuckers are so prolific breeders, we literally have to take everything out of the tank. Yeah, it's almost like cleaning the whole tank out, starting fresh. I mean, I'm literally, thankfully, this is one good thing about Florida, is I can take all the ornaments and the filter and everything else and take it outside and let it bake in the Florida sun for about three days. And yeah. that will and kill so off for, everything. So for a couple of days, the, the little plecos are going to be, the little bristlenos are going to be in, in a, our... That's hospital tank, gallon, yeah, yeah, a little 20, little 20 gallon, gallon hospital. hospital tank. They'll be fine for there for a couple of days. It's just, you know, yeah. they'll be all right. So yeah, um, basically it's just going to be, you know, cleaning out the tank completely. But it's going to be interesting to hear um, people's opinions on snails because some people like snails. I've heard of it. Yeah, but I don't so, think you guys like Malaysian trumpet well, snails. And if you do, you guys are insane. Yeah. <laughs> By all means, like, comment, share, subscribe, mm -hmm. comment. Because, I mean, I was listening to a lady at a... At a at the, at the fish store, mm -hmm. who likes the 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 the, the, ones. the, the, the no the, the small circular with the cheap the purpose rams the rats are I don't know why I think they're gross. Mm -hmm. um, now the big ones, like I said, they, you can use them to help clean your glass. Yeah, you got um, like the apple snails, which but are the big ones. They're like yeah, this big, right? Um, and I see people get those at a garden. Right, but this lady was talking about the small ones. Like yeah. she was excited. She had a whole bunch of them in her tank, and I'm like, oh my gosh, what are you thinking? Because they get in the filter, they get everywhere. I can't even imagine how bad it is with the ram, the the, the trumpet snails. The, I can't even imagine how bad they would gook up a, a regular filter. I mean, we don't have regular filters. We have the sponge, sponge filters. filters. And I'm sure eventually they would eventually manage to clog that up. Yeah. Um, it's harder because it's not a regular filter. Yeah, but But it's I can still remember the, tr the snails, the, well, the one other thing snails. all of those snails did was turn my water great, too. Do you remember oh. that? Yes, yeah. You remember how nasty it was? Because... There'd be a bunch of them, they would die, and then they would, you know... Decompose. Decompose and muck up the water, and it was just yeah. like, what the hell is going wrong with my tank? Yeah, well, now we know. Thousands and thousands of snails. No, we know. Yeah, so, yeah, we don't like snails. The snails are not, we're not, <coughs> not a fan. All. Um, so, I mean, we'll literally, if we see them in the tanks, we literally pick them out as we find them. Yeah. Um, like I said, my tank, I've, I've got a pretty good handle on mine at this point. I have the two different, the yo-yo and the, and, the, and the clown, and I occasionally get a snail there, so I'm sure they're not all dead, yeah. but I'm not seeing them. Um, so I'm sure it's, you know, without, like you, taking everything out and cleaning the whole thing out, there's no well, way you all of them. Yeah, there's just um, no way that Yeah, I these things are relentless. Any snails. I mean, trumpet loaches, trumpet loaches, trumpet, trumpet, trumpet. No, right, trumpet loaches. Trump, no, not loaches, not, not, see? snails. Trumpet oh, snails. God. Trumpet, trumpet snails. snails. Yeah, no, I said it, I was like, that's wrong. Um, and all I another reason for that, but we won't go into it. Um, but the trumpet snails are bad. Like I said, I don't even like the regular snails, the other kind, the like ram's horn or whatever. I'm, I'm not a big fan of snails, so I think snails are gross. It took me a long time to even like, like to touch to pull them out, mm -hmm. but now it's just like, oh, I'll just pull the suckers out of there. <laughs> yeah, you'd rather touch it for a second and yeah. get rid of it rather than let but it But when I first, time. when I first saw it, from the first time I came here and I saw it, I was like, that's disgusting and I'm not touching it. Mm -hmm. And uh, it took me uh, maybe a week of going, I can't, can't handle them in my tank anymore to start yeah. pulling them out. And then, like I said, then I got the loaches. But yeah, I mean, if you have any questions, comments, problems with snails, mm -hmm. uh, by all means, like, yeah. comment, subscribe, share, talk to us about it. Yeah. Um, yeah. Again, loaches work yeah, to loach, some extent. Loaches actually work normally, really great. In uh, except, for your, except, except for your, yeah. your particular... <laughs> well, my yo-yo is an idiot, yeah, but my, I've got a tribe of eight uh, clown loaches in the koi pond. Yeah. Because I used to have a hell of a problem with the, the fact snails. that I bring in plants, not yeah. only for aeration and for, but for uh, food nitrate and, thing, but yeah. also for food for the fish. And I would get snails all over the place, and they would clog up my filter like every all week. The time, and, yeah. and you know, I use huge filters for the koi pod, and those snails would get all in there and, and yep. you know, crap them out. Yeah. I ended up getting eight clown loaches, which I was told you can't put clown loaches in a pond. It's like, well, I got an indoor pond, and yes, I can. Yep, and, and yep. you did, and mm -hmm. they have done an amazing job. I haven't seen a snail well, in there in no, years. No, I haven't either. I see a bunch of dead shells <laughs> yeah. when I clean out the when the I sump. clean out the sump. There'll be a bunch of shells, and that's it. Yeah. And uh, yeah, they take care of those snails, you know, like. Yeah, and like I said, my tank, I was, I had a pretty bad infestation, and I got uh, originally I just had the one loach, and they got the second one, and I haven't had any. So I mean, they do a good job, most yeah. of them, except for your one. Yeah, I've um, got Yoya, who is more interested um, in playing with my rope fish than Yeah, which snails. we have video, I think, of that, of oh, him yeah. playing around. But anyway, so loaches are always a good thing for snails. Mm -hmm. uh, but not the trumpet, I don't think the trumpet snails, I don't think they can keep up with them. I think well, they're just... I, yeah, it's just the trumpet snails just breed way too fast. Yeah, I think it's just now, way too... Now, like I mentioned with the adults, I was able to use salt to kill off a bunch of them, but that didn't kill the eggs. Right. So, right. And you can't, you can't and you constantly can't, salt like, the water because like, there's baby... Baby yeah, I could, and now, now, if they were all adult fish, I would have been able to put more salt in. Yeah, you just got to be careful. But I couldn't do that since I have. Like, yeah, apparently the trumpet snails don't like, uh, well, don't, no like snails do. yeah, don't like salt. Yeah, don't like salt.
No um, snails do, except for marine snails, but these aren't marine snails, right. these are garden snails. So, uh, salt will... Uh, snails are evil. Yes, salt that will fan. Kill, kill the snails, but you can't put too much salt in your aquarium or you'll end up killing your fish too. And, right. your, plants and your plants and, and else, yeah, the plants. So. But anyway, yeah, if you have any qu questions, comments about snails, mm -hmm. we'd be happy to find out if we don't know. Uh, pray you don't get trumpet snails because they're horrible. Oh, the goodness. other ones are bad enough, which I still ram's yeah. horn, rams? ram ram's horn, and ram's there's horn. a couple other types too. Yeah. But, but yeah, the trumpet. Those snails are the two are the that worst. we really deal with the most. Yeah, I've never yeah. seen the trumpet snails. I hope I never get any in my tank. Yeah, um, I've just been really lucky that they've stayed contained to the one yeah, tank. Yeah, yeah. Gotta be oh careful. They stay contained to the one tank. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so that's that's pretty much where we stand with snails. We don't like them. No. Um, yeah, and if you like them, we're sorry. And uh, you can comment and complain at us. We, yeah. We're more than I mean, if you like snails for a pet, that's fine. They're not, you know, these are not screwing up your biosystem. These are not pet snails. These are yeah. not like I mean, I these I, are pest snails. These are pesty pest snails. Yeah, the S is on a different uh, area. <laughs> <laughs> it's not P P E T S. It's P E S T. Right. Yeah. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah. That's. <laughs> That's kind of cute. I like that. Oh, I'm glad. Yeah, no, okay. I have no life. <laughs> but uh, again, like, comment, subscribe, share, mm -hmm. buy, buy a yeah, shirt. I'm wearing a shirt again. Yeah, um, I'm not. She is not. Slap I'm her. wearing my. I, I'm in the spooky shit shirt. That's great. Yeah, isn't it? That's great. I love my shirts. Um, yeah, she has many shirts. Yes, I do. Uh, many different sayings and many different shirts. I, she needs to buy more of our shirts. I know, oh, right? Shirt. Oh, here it is. Here we go. Yeah. yeah. But um, yeah, right. but yeah. So anyway, <laughs> it was nice talking to you and again. If you have any questions or comments, you know, we'd love to hear from you. Mm -hmm. And have a good evening. And we'll see you next time.